Hey family members, if you are preparing for Accenture, then this video is for you. Why? Because we are going to discuss about the most important topic for your technical assessment. From technical assessment, there will be total 10 to 15 pseudo code questions. So you have to prepare for that. As you know, guys, last year on campus has been conducted by Marshall Metal, and we are going to discuss about the Marshall Metal questions only, which has been asked earlier for Accenture. Okay now let me discuss those questions just before that guys one request to you if you have not subscribed this channel yet then please make sure that you are sus subscribing this channel and watching the playlist of accenture or any company that you want and let me know which content you want more okay hey you ready for the future tech no uf is here with premium prep materials no need to fear cognizant accenture tcs and more we'll get you ready open up that door so at first the value of p q r are initialized okay guys if you don't know how to solve a uh, pseudo code then please access the playlist of accenture there we have already uploaded one separate video for pseudo code if you don't know how to solve then you will be able to solve the pseudo code so please access the playlist of accenture at techno uf youtube channel okay now the question is this if p q r are initialized as these values and if 5 plus r less than p so let me just calculate first okay 5 plus r that means 9 plus 5 14 if this is lesser than p p is 1 so you can see this is greater right so it's false it's false so it will not be executed okay it's false guys very carefully observe that this else is for this if okay and this if is for what you have to you have to check that okay this if is not executed so that's why else will be executed right so in else there is another if so you have to perform this if q plus 7 plus r is greater than r plus 4 uh, i mean q plus 7 plus 4 is it greater than r plus 4 so q means 9 plus 7 is 16 plus 4 is 20 right so 20 is greater than r plus 4 r means 9 9 plus 4 is 13 okay so you have to execute this line okay r plus 4 is 13 so you have to sorry uh, yeah you have to execute this line q is equal to q plus p plus r so q plus p means uh q is 8 plus p 9 plus r so that is 17 okay so you have to end the if lock so immediate if is this so this if is ended here okay and this if is ended here now q is equal to new value of q is equal to p plus p so p plus p means 2 okay and this q is overridden this q is overridden so now this q values is 2 okay now what is the value of p plus q plus r that is q is 2 p is 1 1 plus 2 is 3 3 plus 9 is 12 okay so the correct answer will be on the first value okay i hope you understood guys if you didn't get it then please watch the video again and if you want me to repeat again and again then please let me know in the comment section i'll again discuss in the comment section okay now the next question is will, will be a quiz question for you please solve this problem and this will be regarding zor operations and operations logical and uh bitwise and operations bitwise zor operations so you have to perform these operations to get the value of pseudo code okay so please give the answer in the comment section i'll discuss the zor operations and and operations in the next question so just wait and then solve this problem okay i hope we will do so the next question is this guys these are the real questions which has been asked by Marshall metal for accenture only okay so if you if you perform well in this quiz in this video then you will be able to solve the real questions in your case as well okay so i hope you will give importance before i discuss the answer i want you to have the best prime materials for accenture where we have included all the recent and updated questions with answers like for gamified round questions and pseudo codes cloud and networking ms office 
एंड बैक एंड कोडिंग क्वेश्चन आंसर फ्रंट एंड क्वेश्चन स्कीवल क्वेश्चन कम्युनिकेशन असेसमेंट एंड इंटरव्यू एक्सपीरियंसिस ऑल ऑफ दीज आर एवेलेबल एट टॉप मेन टू टाइस लाइस टेक्नोलॉज का यू एफ द लिंक इज प्रोवाइडेड इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स और इन द कमेंट सेक्शन प्लीज गो थ्रू दैट थाउजेंड मोर दैन थाउजेंड्स आर प्रिपेयरिंग थ्रू दीज यू कैन सी दीज आर अपडेटेड अप टू टू डे एंड यू विल गेट इंस्टेंट एक्सेस एंड एंड फॉर permanent and unlimited access okay it will keep updating every day so please go through that you can see this is the feedback of students provided uh, here okay so i hope you will go through that this is nothing in front of your 6.5 lk job i hope you'll consider it okay now the question is this if r minus q is less than p minus r then perform this r minus q means 5 minus 7 so this is minus 2 okay is it lesser than p minus r p is 0 minus 5 so it is minus 5 so you have to know that minus 2 is greater than minus 5 okay and this is that's why false okay this condition is false it is greater not lesser okay so that's why it's false so we don't have to execute this line we just directly go to else block okay here in if we have to again perform this operations R plus Q minus P, R five Q seven, so twelve minus P is that that is zero. So twelve is it lesser than four plus R that is nine. So is it fine? Is it okay? So it is false, right? It's false. We don't have to execute this line as well. So for this if the corresponding end if is hit this right. and for this if the corresponding end if is this okay now just perform this line r is equal to q plus p that is 5 plus uh r is equal to 7 plus 0 so that is 7 right so new value of 7 uh, r is 7 so the value of r is overridden now now what is the value of p plus q plus r so p the value of p is not updated so that is 0 and value of q is 7 and value of r is 5 So five plus seven is equal to twelve. So that's the output. Okay, you can see. Sorry, uh, sorry. R is seven, right? So fourteen. So fourteen is the output. So this is the correct answer. I hope your answer is also same, guys. Please give me the answer before I give in the comment section, right? So that you'll you'll also get some confidence from here. Okay. Now go through the next question. So at first, the value of a, b, and c are initialized as these. At first, the value of like at first we have to check the if condition. So two plus nine plus c is equal to what? Two plus nine is eleven plus c is nineteen. Okay, and is it less than three plus a? Three plus a means three plus zero. So three. Is it true? No. Nineteen is greater, right? So it's false. So we don't have to execute this line. We don't have to execute. So there is is a catch. What's the catch? That is. After seeing the presentation of if and else, people will start executing this else block. Okay, okay. I I think you would also have made this mistake if I didn't notify you. So that's the problem. That is, you can see this if is corresponding to this else. Okay, and this if is corresponding to this end if. Okay. i mean this if is corresponding to this end if and this if is corresponding to this end if guys if this is not executed if this is false then why would we check this if block else block we will ignore this right so for this if we have to end after the if block okay now print the value of a plus b plus c so a is 0 b is 2 c is 8 so 2 plus 8 is 10 that's the output. okay i hope you understood most of the time you will see the pseudo code problems will be very big very long but most of the time those will take lesser time to solve because most of the time e block will not be executed will it will not be true it will be false and you don't have to execute all of those lines so that's the shortcut tricks you have to know okay now the next question is guys if you don't know about the e block for uh, for loop and zor operations and operations please go through the playlist we have already uploaded the pseudo code video there you can uh, learn about that okay so please go through that so this question again repeating uh so we don't have to go through this guys this question i have already solved right so please give the answer in the comment section okay uh did i solve 
yes i have already solved this case please give the answer in the comment section i have already solved again please solve and give the answer guys i had to share only this much of questions at today if you found this video helpful if this video added value to your career your preparation then please follow the playlist and essential and subscribe this channel watch the playlist of any company that you want and let me know which content do you want more and also please follow the materials where you have already the recent questions and the previous questions the link is provided in the description box or in the comment section please go through that thank you please subscribe to techno uf and don't forget to like and share with your friends